All right, what's up? I'm Charm City 187. Yo, uh, there was a shooting at the uh, Columbia Mall this morning in Howard County. Um, I live on the opposite side of Howard County. It's like, I don't know, 10, 15 minutes away, but uh, three people dead so far. Um, one person dead near, according to Howard County Police now, near ammunition and a gun, which... So what, did the guy just... God, yo, this shit already sounds like bullshit. Um, let's see. A half hour after Fox News reported that there was a shooter in the Columbia Mall, the police still weren't on scene. There was no uh, scanner traffic whatsoever. As soon as I saw it on Fox News, I turned on the scanner... No scanner traffic whatsoever. Um, there was a former uh, police detective on Fox News who said he was at Columbia Mall this morning, or drove past it. He said he goes there usually about once a month. Was driving towards D.C. Now, this is this morning, and he said he saw a parade of... Cop cars, detectives, and crime scene uh, vans on the way to, the, uh, I guess, Columbia, or because 495 goes right past Columbia. A parade of police vehicles going that way before the shooting even started. Um, no, number one, I don't understand how a half hour after the shooting started, there wasn't any police on scene when there's three police stations all around the mall. There, There's like three police stations within, I don't know, five miles of the mall. So that, that right there doesn't make any sense. Um, yo, it, it, it was just, it's, I don't know, it just didn't seem right, like, <laughs> I mean, it, it's disgusting, but. I mean, th this is the shit that Martin O'Malley promised wouldn't happen last year if they got all their gun control laws pushed through. Which, in the end, they got them all pushed through. And what happened? This happens. So, we're one of the strictest gun control states in the country. This is the kind of shit that happens <laughs> here. So, it's obvious that gun control doesn't fucking work. Just like, uh... Just like up in Newtown, Connecticut. They are the strictest gun control... Uh, have the strictest gun control laws in the country. And look what happened there. So, I mean, I, I think it's quite obvious that gun control doesn't work. But it's going to take, like, thousands and thousands of people getting mowed down for these fucking po asshole politicians to figure out that... They, people need guns to protect themselves, so until that happens, you're going to have shit like this where one guy is alone in a mall for, I don't know, 45 minutes until police can actually get there, so, hey, just think, yo, I live about 20, 25 minutes away from uh, Columbia Mall. If that shit were to happen, like, if somebody were to break into my house, I've had to call the police before. It takes them an hour to get here. So what the fuck am I supposed to do if somebody tries to do that shit to me? I'm going to be sitting here waiting, what, probably two hours for them if it's that important. I mean, it took them over a half hour to get five blocks to the fucking mall. But yeah. Three dead. One person dead near a pile of ammunition and a gun. Which... That right there throws up red flags. So what did he do? Just take a backpack full of ammunition, sit it down somewhere in the mall, spread it all out, and then load it up and start shooting people and then just die there? That doesn't make any fucking sense whatsoever. And if he has that much ammunition, why the hell is he only killing three people at 11 o'clock on a Saturday when the mall is probably jam-packed. It just doesn't make any fucking sense. Plus that coupled with the uh, detective seeing a parade of police vehicles going to towards the mall hours before the shooting really doesn't make any fucking sense whatsoever. But, hey. 
I don't know. It sounds like bullshit to me, but... Alright, I'm out. Peace.